Ooh, the emotions of the full moon should be starting to take effect. So the full moon energy will start two or three days before the full moon and it carries on to two to three days after the full moon. So today you may start feeling different kinds of emotions. You may feel all kinds of things. Frustration, sadness, depression. It affects everyone different, differently. So be aware of that and be aware of what you're feeling in the moment when it's out of the norm. It's just temporary. Look at the source. Look at what's where it's coming from. Ask yourself, okay, what's triggering this? Why is it really here? Why am I feeling this way when I normally don't feel this way? And then deal with it as, as you need to. One thing you can do is to get outside. I know it's fall and for some areas of the world, it could be getting quite chilly. It could be getting quite cold. But try to get outside and touch the earth. That means put your bare feet on the ground or you can sit on a rock, lean up against a tree. You got to touch the earth in some way. What that's going to do is it's going to pull all of that toxic energy out of you and refill you with fresh renewed energy. So it can lighten the effects of that full moon energy that's coming in. Plus it's in the sign of Taurus. Mm, 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 mm. Bullheaded, right? So that can be difficult to deal with and you may have some feelings coming up like just feels like it's out of the blue like where did this come from so you need to investigate within yourself of why you're feeling the way you're feeling and it could just be the moon <laughs> and also be paying attention for those secrets to be revealed have a great day everyone and remember you have the power to create the life you've always dreamed of you do you really do Get outside, touch the earth, cleanse your space, do your meditations, and remember this Wyatt, the wolf, the raven, and spirit, we're sending you unconditional love. Mwah.